All right, we've already talked about this one. He goes off at 300. If he goes off at 300, then this is 30, so this is 60. This is 40, so I have a 90 degree triangle there, don't I? Or I can use sine law with 90 and 40. So I'm gonna go ahead and do sine law. Sine of 90 over 40 equals sine of 60 over at, or, well, let's call it W, because it's west, and it equals sine of 30 over N for north. Then I just do the math. 40 sine 30 divided by sine 90 equals north, and 40 sine 60 divided by sine 90 equals west. And the answers, since sine 90 equals 1, is 40 sine 30, north equals 20, and west, 40 sine 60, is 34.64. Find the length of x, since I have a pair there, it's sine law. I'll change order just to show you it works both ways. Sine 30 equals x over sine 65. Multiply the pair, divide the spare. 5 sine 65 over sine 30 equals x, which equals... In triangle ABC, foom, 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 A is 77. The way I've drawn it, this is the biggest triangle, so I'm going to make that C, which makes this 16, which makes this 28. I want this side, little b. Again, I have a pair because I know that this is 180 minus 77 minus 28. This is 75 degrees. So sine 75 over 16 equals sine 28 over B. 16 sine 28 over sine 75 equals B, which is 34.64. Apart, determine these other two lengths. Well, you know this angle right here is 92. So, sine 92 over 251 has to equal sine 32 over x, and it has to equal sine 56 over y. So, do that first. x equals 251 sine 32 divided by sine 92, which equals... And y equals 251 sine 56 over sine 92. Is 208.2. Determine the area of the park. Well, to do the area of the park, I've got a base, but I just need a height. So all I gotta do is since I know x is 133.1, I know this height, and I'm going to call it uh, w, no, w is bad. I'm going to go ahead, I don't want to call it h because of hypotenuse, but I am going to call it h. Uh, sine 56 equals the height over 133.1, 
So 133.1 sine 56 equals H. Is 110.3. So then the area equals base 251 times height 110.3 divided by 2. Thirteen thousand eight hundred and forty-two point six five. This is across the marsh, so this is side, angle, side, so this is cosine law. This is what I need, so it's C. C squared equals, I'm not going to do C squared, I'm going to do it all in one go. C equals the square root of 47 squared plus 38 squared minus 2 times 47 times 38 times cos 65, which equals... this many times. Oops, that was crap. We know this is 20, we know this is 15, we know this is 140. So this is again c equals the square root of 15 squared plus 20 squared minus 2 times 15 times 20 times cos 140. And that equals... And the triangle measures fourteen, sixteen, twenty five. Smallest angle is right here, so I'm going to make that C. These guys don't matter. So, cos C. I'm going to, of course, reverse this. C equals the shift cos of uh, 14 squared minus 16 squared minus 25 squared over negative 2 times 16 times 25, which equals... Negative 685 over 800, which is 31 degrees. And that's it.